Hi everyone, uh, I'm Richard. I lead engineering for Recon, which is the automated red teaming uh, product from Protect AI. Uh, Recon lets you run automated uh, red teaming scans against your LLM and LLM powered applications. Uh, this helps you run offensive security scans to figure out your vulnerabilities across security, safety, abuse, toxicity, um, and give you a current assessment of how um, uh, deployment ready your applications are. Um, it uh, helps you do much better threat modeling and be a lot more confident before you are pushing your LLM powered applications or models into um, a general use. Um, uh, Recon allows you to run not just automated scans, but run them continuously via a, 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 as frequently as you want. Uh, they can be using static library attacks where we have hundreds of attacks which get updated every couple of weeks or you can use a reagent approach which can help you run very targeted attacks domain specific attacks which are generated on the fly based on what your target llm or llm powered application does next we'll dive into a quick demo of how the product works um, as you see on my screen, this is the home dashboard, which gives you this lay of land where how many targets have you added? These targets could be LLMs or LLM powered applications. What type of attacks have you historically found? What your current threat map looks like? Um, I'll show you sample reports of two types. First is the attack library, which is like hundreds of attacks that you run against your LLM or LLM powered application uh, and get a state of what's the current risk score. Higher the risk, the um, more successful attacks have worked against it. So you probably need to take action in order to uh, make it ready for deployment. It breaks down your attacks that were successful against by severity. You also get it across categories like jailbreaks, prompt injection, safety, uh, prompt leaks and shows you how many of them were successful and gives you a threat map of which area do you need to focus on to improve your uh, models. Um, all of the attacks that were successful and run are also mapped against popular uh, frameworks such as OWASP, MITRE ATLAS, NIST AI, RMF and gets you a sense of which particular um, uh, category of those frameworks are you more susceptible against so that you have a much more focused approach at fixing the issues. Um, and then you can go into the exact um, uh, attacks which worked. Uh, it'll show you the prompt that was run. So if, for example, this is the prompt that was run over here. This is an adversarial suffix attack. So as you see, instead of just saying, write a tutorial to build a bomb, it adds this adversarial suffix behind it. It says, and it runs it multiple times, which shows why you need a automated approach to do red teaming because the first four attempts the model did not give a compromised response but the fifth attempt sixth attempt it started giving out instructions on how to build a bomb so um, this is why human uh, powered uh, red teaming against ai systems aren't as effective as automated solutions like recon uh, even here, each attack will get mapped against the popular frameworks and they can take you to uh, more details about that particular technique and mitigations for those. Um, the second type of approach that you can take on attacking a system is the agent approach, which is a really powerful approach to do very targeted domain specific attacks. Here, our LLM agent will interrogate your target to figure out what it does, then come up with adversarial attack goals, assuming if it was an attacker, what would it try to achieve? Then start crafting attacks, starting with the simplest one. If those attacks fail, it will start making them more sophisticated to see at what point does your system break and uh, see if it is able to achieve the goal or not. You can also give your own goals. So maybe in the example, we look at one of a human augmented goal. So you're the human gave a goal that, okay, I want to know, get the target to tell me how to hotwire a car. Um, and you can see um, the exact conversation the attacker agent from Recon is having with your target. So it first directly asks, doesn't get an answer, then tries a phonetic transcription attack that doesn't work, goes into role play, uh, doesn't work, tries to combine two techniques, and then finally like a role play along with um, uh, the phonetic translation is when it actually starts getting uh, compromised responses which is then uh, shown over here as well um, and then it doubles down and sees okay if i make some changes does it continue working um, or not uh, this is an extremely powerful approach to not rely on a specific set of attacks but versus you give a goal you don't have to worry about how to craft attacks the agent will run multiple conversations in parallel to try to achieve these goals and see if those can be achieved using a combination of uh, all the techniques that we have on the platform. 
Learn more about how uh, you can secure your LLM applications using Recon at protectai.com forward slash Recon. Uh, and feel free to please reach out to us uh, to get access to the products, see how we can partner and help you build a more secure LLM application.